So, the first problem is it's not the same brick. Let's move to the next mm -hmm. picture. The second problem is that the coping stones, you say, that's the stones at the top, yeah. haven't been laid properly. Yeah, and Correct? I said this to Neil, and he said, well, the 70 pound notes then. Huh. Do you remember a conversation of that kind? No. And there's a third picture and a fourth picture. Let's have a look. Can I see both of them? What, what's that a picture of? It looks well, like... Well, you can see all the salt damage, you know. Salt damage? It's, it's made the bricks pro uh, porous. Right. So you say... It's weakened the wall. OK. You say the wall hasn't been built properly. Looks like a wall to me. And although you've got no qualifications, mm -hmm. you have had an independent person or people look at that wall mm -hmm. who have informed you that, A, the wall has not been built to a decent standard, the standard of a good builder. Yes? Yeah. Decent builder. And what's more, it's unsafe. Correct? They're loose. And, yeah. and what's more, it's going to cost £825 to build. Do you accept or do you acknowledge any of the criticisms that Deborah has made about the building of this wall? The salt damage, the fact that the bricks aren't the same and the fact that the coping stones haven't been laid properly? The salt damage is because the wall's 100 years old. So you used the same bricks that had fallen down? No, we used new bricks. My bricks start from the bottom... I see. ..from one brick and then gradually build themselves up. You can see the blend of bricks as they go up towards where the top of the coping stones are. I see. And, and they were like for like bricks. The difference in the in the mortar mix is because metric bricks and imperial bricks are different sizes. Right. So you can't make you can't make them join together perfectly because they're diff completely different sizes. Now, are you a builder? Uh, no, I'm not a builder. And uh, the person who built this was your brother. Correct? Yes. Is your brother a qualified builder? He is. How long has he been a qualified builder for? Ten years. Uh, you've got a statement, in fact, from your brother. Correct. Yeah. That you brought me to court. Are you aware of any complaints that have been made against him or against the quality of his work? No. In 2011, my brother Neil hired me to assess and repair the damage to his garden wall. With some assistance from him, we completed the job to a proficient standard. We later replaced and repaired his neighbour's section of the wall at no cost to them. In my professional opinion, the wall is still structurally sound. 